Right, so in this video, we're going to show how to solve inequalities like this. Negative 5x minus 25 is greater than or equal to 10. A couple of things before we get started. Uh, it will. These are much easier if you know the rules for adding and subtracting positive and negative numbers or integers, and also multiplying and dividing positive and negative numbers. And uh, I've created a video to help you there, and I'll leave uh, a link below. Okay. Um, what our goal is, is just to get x by itself, okay? So, let's get started. First thing we can do is we can add 25 to both sides, okay? So, I'll bring a line down. I'm going to add 25 to both sides. These cancel each other out. I'm going to bring down the 5x. Here's the inequality sign, and 10 plus 25 is 35, so far, so good. Now, I need to get x by itself, and I can divide each side by negative 5. Okay? Negative 5. Now, here's where you need to remember. Anytime you multiply or divide with inequalities with a negative number, you switch the sign. So, I'm going to switch the sign from greater than equal to to less than or equal to. Go ahead. The 5's cancel, so the x comes down. And then 5 divided by 35 is um, 7. But now, is the 7 positive or negative? Well, anytime you have a positive divided by a negative or a negative divided by a positive, it becomes a negative number. So it will be x is less than or equal to 7. Okay, let's work another one. I want to get x by itself. I'm going to subtract 3 from each side. So, draw a line, these cancel, this becomes 3x, okay? And then, now with this, we have a negative number minus 3. So, I like to change it to an addition, so I'm going to uh, change subtraction to addition, to addition. So, that means I need to put the opposite sign on negative 3. So, now I have negative 6 plus a negative 3, which is negative 9. Divide each side by 3. Okay, here's my inequality sign. Divide each number side by 3. But do I need to switch the signs? No, because it is not negative, so it will be x is greater than or equal to... Remember, you have a negative and a positive, so that will be negative 3. So there's your answer on that one. Okay, let's try one more. See if we've got a handle on this. Can't get the sheet of paper. And here we go. Okay, we have, uh, I will add four. Add four. Uh, these cancel, bring down the negative 6x. There's my sign. 32 plus 4 is 36. Divide each side by negative 6. These cancel. Divide by negative 6. Bring down the x. The sign switch because we are dividing by a negative number. 36 divided by negative 6 is 6. And it's going to be a negative number. So it is x is greater than or equal to negative 6. There we go. I hope that helps in solving inequalities. Thanks for watching, and Movie Math uploads a new math and science video every day. Please subscribe and share.